Okay, so only four chords in this one. First chord is going to be a B minor seven. I'm going to play it like this. Now I'm barring the entire seventh fret with my first finger. And then I'm adding my third finger to the ninth fret of the A string. Okay, chord number two is going to be a D major. Now, we're not going to play uh, as a full bar chord like this, but we're only going to play this little triad here. So that is the uh, seventh fret on the D string, the G string, and the B string there. So, so it comes from that A shaped bar chord. We're only playing um, the seventh fret of those three strings: the D string, G string, and B string. So we get this. Okay. Chord number three is an F sharp minor seven. And we're going to bar the 9th fret from the A string down. Our 3rd finger will play the 11th fret of the D string. And our middle finger will play the 10th fret of the, of the B string. So it's that chord. So. One thing I'll say about that chord, um, when I play this, I actually hammer on the uh, section of the chord that isn't barred. Um, so it'll be like this. Okay. And the last chord is going to be an E major. But like our D major, we only play that triad on the D string, G string and B string. Okay, so I'll play all those chords without the strumming just so you can hear the progression. So it's a B minor 7, D major, F sharp minor 7, and E major. So they are the chords. Now let's look at the right hand, which is more important, I'd probably say, than the left hand. Okay, guys, so they were the chords for Get Lucky. I'm going to play it again so you can see what I'm doing with my right hand, and then I'll break it down for you. Okay, so what you'll notice there is that I'm maintaining a 16th note up and down picking. This is fairly constant throughout the entire song. Um, it's typical of Nara Rogers. And what we do is when we're playing the chords, like in um, Long Train Running, when we wanted to mute stuff, we just lift the chord shape off. And we do that at various points within those 16th notes to create the accents that we want to play. Now, I'll play it again just doing the accents so you can hear where they fall within those 16th notes. Okay, so the first three are all the same. Obviously that F sharp minor chord has the hammer on it as well. The E major is a little bit different, so uh, I'll go from the start so you get the whole sense of the riff.
So that last one is a little bit different. Now I'll play it again, but I'll add in the 16th note um, muting this time so you can hear the whole thing. Okay, so that was Get Lucky, uh, another awesome riff. Uh, if you like these videos and um, you know you like what you see and want to hear more riffs, then please subscribe below. Um, yeah, so awesome riff number four. We'll be with you very soon. Cheers.